what is more important in life, love or career? Love. Love is always the answer. Uh, what exactly a love means in women's dictionary? Love means that you can't stop thinking about something. Um, women are very intuitive, so it's it's going to it's going to be really deep within her heart and her whole core being. So if it's a guy, then she's going to think about him 18 hours a day. Um, if it's her career that she's loving, she's just going to leap out of bed and, and get straight to work and just enjoy it. What, according to you, uh, Western girls thinks about Indian guys? Um, I think they've got gorgeous eyes. Um, all the all the Indian guys I've seen, they they're very handsome. Would you like to go out with them? Uh, well, my my other half wouldn't be very happy about that. <laughs> Three things which girls hate about guys. If a guy is self-absorbed and has a huge ego, that's that's not going to do it. Um, arrogance is is not good. Uh, there's no empathy if they're not sitting and listening to a girl. And girls do like to be listened to. We have have quite a lot to talk about. <laughs> Okay. So they need to be good listeners. How does a guy how does a guy know uh, if a woman likes him or So if she texts back straight away, that's a, a good indicator. Um so any kind of engagement or um interaction that happens quickly, um then that that's a good sign. Do you think that girls likes to be chased? To an extent, not a creepy extent. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, take note this point. Now, when you say not to the creepy extent, what exactly it means? So there's there's a very fine line between um, having a guy chase you, and then it it getting kind of stalky, uh, stalkery, and a bit too creepy. Um, so if, if she's saying repeatedly, you know, or playing it cool repeatedly, and almost brushing the person off, they probably should you know take a step back. If you're single, what kind of signs you will give to the men to attract towards you? The eye contact. Mm -hmm. If someone is making lingering eye contact with you, then they're probably in with a good chance and you should definitely make a move. That is your opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, being flirtatious, oh. just laughing and giggling. Mm -hmm. Again, good signs. Do you think that girls like men with beard or without beard? Uh, some of them says that actually beer turns them on. Do you think is that could That's be the right. case? Yeah, it can do. Yeah. Beards can turn a woman on. Can do. Okay. What kind of beard? Basically, little beard or big beard? A medium size beard. <laughs> medium size. <laughs> Why girls likes bad guys? Oh, um, probably because they're a bit naughty, a bit racy. Or do girls check out guys? Definitely yes. And what exactly they check out? Um, so looks, um, personality, humour. Um, Humans very important. Uh, do women like uh, muscular guys or non-muscular? Um, I can only speak from personal experience. I would say not not bodybuilder types, not like the the big kind of gym muscle men. That's not. But a, a good fit, um, lean person, someone who, who's who's fit, but just okay. av averagely. What, what is wrong with bodybuilders? It's like a character from a I don't know cartoon movie. <laughs> what girls do when they're alone? Me, I, I kind of just, well, as an entrepreneur, I'm always working on, on business. So, and what context are we talking about here? <laughs> <laughs> Anything. <laughs> they, they can do probably everything that a man does when they're on their own. <laughs> uh, does the looks really matter? No, I think um, once you, you get to know somebody's personality, like you can, I, I've known really, really stunningly good looking people, men and women, but they're, the characters are so kind of shallow and bland that it's almost like once you get to know them, they stop looking good because mm -hmm. you, you're seeing inside them. And I've known people who are very average looking, mm -hmm. but their, their personality is so beautiful that they look beautiful. So you're actually seeing them rather than their looks. So I don't think... Um, but I think that looks does matter in the first... first, first Impressions instance. count, yes. How do you impress a girl, you know, especially for the guys, you know, who are totally clueless? Okay. Um, so you need to listen to her, be very attentive. Um, attention is the most like, precious commodity a guy can give to a girl. Okay. She wants to feel like she is, is the whole world for him. That might not be the case, but she wants to feel like she is. Okay, what woman wants? Random acts of kindness is always good. So um, random acts of thoughtfulness. So, you know, if you've had a really tough day and then someone just... Like my partner, I work in a hospital as, as well as being an entrepreneur. So sometimes I'll come back and I'm absolutely shattered, and he will just make me this just beautiful meal, um, and you know just be really thoughtful 
and it's those little things they don't need to cost money um, even just like sending a text in the middle of the day that you're not expecting those things are, are really good uh, do you think uh, women don't know what they really want yeah probably <laughs> <laughs> And it's always changing as well. <laughs> because our documentary is not going anywhere. And why do you think guys find it so difficult to understand women? <laughs> yeah, because we're always changing our mind. <laughs> so How is it? Like, so for example, you met a guy and you like him. Do you think that you'll be changing your mind not to like him again? They've got to keep the interest up. See, the thing is, I mean, I've been with my partner for 16 years, but it feels like we only met, like, last month. Because... You know, I'll, I'll wake up in the morning and he looks at me like he's only just met me. And it always keeps things fresh. There's no complacency. I think the moment you get complacent in a relationship and take each other for granted, then it's going to just get very boring and then everyone will change their mind. Any last three tips for the guys if they really want to have a lasting relationship with a woman? <sighs> just make her feel like a queen. <laughs> yeah. Put all, all notions of chauvinism out the door and just treat her like she's a queen. Thank you so much, Darcy. Thank you so much for your time. <laughs> I hope it helps.